Ham Stadium. It's the last home game of the year. Come out and support the Skyhawks. Coach, let's talk about Southeast Missouri 2 and 3 in the OVC 2 and 5 overall, but coming off the win over Austin P. Tell us about the Southeast Missouri team. The, the uh, 2010 OVC Conference Champions mm -hmm. you know, beat us 27 14 at their place last year in front of a great crowd. Now, now, we have beat them for the last five years, but they obviously got us last year and did a great job and went to the playoffs. So, uh, you know, that's certainly on our mind. Uh, this year's team, uh, they've had a few injuries at the running back position, but, you know, they, as you know, Shovel, the quarterback, is is for, you know, everybody's money in the league. That's the guy, you know, you don't want to bet against if the game's close at the end of it. And they've had some games that have been very lopsided to where his maturity and playmaking ability hasn't really been a factor. Uh -huh. But that's it's certain, something I'm very concerned about because there's a lot of option stuff. So you don't, you know, all of a sudden you play well, you play well, then all of a sudden one of those options go, and you know now you're down seven nothing. Defensively, uh, very concerning to me because they're they're a zone blitz team. They're always bringing pressure uh, from somewhere, but they always play a, a safety in the middle of the field. So there's no easy post, there's no deep throws because they play cover three and keep everything in front of you, and they try to make you go 12, you know, 10, 12 plays to score. Uh, and we haven't proven that we're patient enough to do that. Awesome P, we did. Uh, but besides that, I don't think we've really proved that we're that we're patient enough to do that. Okay, challenging team. And plus, it's the last home game of the year. It year. is. A lot of seniors going out. It's the last home game. We love playing in front of our family and friend and our home crowd. Uh, move the game up. Hopefully, it's a bright, sunny day. Uh, you know, so no excuse. I hope you guys are there. We need to be 4-1, uh, you know, at our home, in our home stadium. Get us to 4-2 and two in the conference. You know, next week we'll go play, you know, bowl game in Stark, in Stark Vegas there. Yeah. <laughs> you know, and have fun with that. But, uh, you know, I want to get it to where these last two games are like playoffs to us to, to see what we can do. Okay. I see the glow of the lights at Graham Stadium. It must mean you have practice <laughs> tonight, gotta go, right? Got to go. Got to go. Thank you. This is Coach Jason Thanks, Simpson. Chris. We'll have uh, more with him on our pregame show Saturday. And, again, that's a 2 o'clock kickoff now. 1 o'clock, uh, Randy Barnes, myself, Gary Capers, and John Abel will be on the radio. And then at 1.30, we'll send it up the booth with Tom Britt and Coach Simpson in our pregame. More on the way from Snappy Tomato Pizza on the Skyhawk Sports Network. I'm at a theme park sipping on an ice-cold Coca-Cola about to try the newest, scariest roller coaster. Extreme Death Terror, the 